Hey, how's it going, everybody? Welcome to Finance with Abram. I just want to do a quick unboxing of the Apple card that I recently received. I recently uploaded a video on my YouTube channel about the application process. So yeah, I went through the whole application process, got approved for the card, and I was able to use Apple Pay right away because it was linked to my you know, iPhone and the wallet app. So yeah, I could use the card that day, later that day, the next day. But I also wanted the physical titanium card because... It looks nice. I'm just going to say, I'm not mostly going to use Apple Pay when I use the car because when you use Apple Pay with the Apple Card, you get 2% cash back everywhere that Apple Pay is accepted. Now, if you use the card at like the Apple Store or, you know, Apple subscriptions or anything related to Apple basically officially, then you get 3% cash back. And if you use the physical card, which is in this right here, then you get 1% cash back. So really, it's going to be kind of like a backup for me personally because I have other physical cards that I can get, you know, 2% cash back at. Before I jump into this unboxing, I'm going to tell you how quick it was with me receiving the card. So apply for the car around noon on a Monday. And then after the application was pretty much complete, they asked, do I want a physical car? And I show that in the video and everything that I uploaded recently. And I stated, yes, I want a physical car. So I got an email that day, I believe. And it stated that I would receive the car within four to six days. And then a couple days later on a Wednesday, I received an email stating that my Apple car was on the way with a tracking number. And then on Friday, a couple of days after that, I received the Apple car in the mail via UPS. And it was very official like they took a picture of it stating you know proof of delivery and i'll show that on the screen and everything of course black out some information but yeah so they took a picture of it after they delivered it and it was a quick process like i stated on a monday and then about four business days later i received the car so let's get into it here and i kind of already opened up a couple of pieces of it because i wasn't sure what this was actually because i was actually expecting something else in an envelope similar to this so i was like opening it up and i was like oh that's that okay i want to save that for an unboxing video so this part was sealed and then this part also was sealed but i took that off and I was like oh this is the apple car so yeah let me save that for later all right that's about as far as I've gotten so this is going to be all new to me from here on out so let's see slide that out that is it in here very sturdy box right there and there is the apple logo apple is somewhat known for their packaging they like to make it real sleek and minimalistic but you know it feels you know, important and also expensive. <laughs> so yeah, with their Apple products or uh, definitely, you know, towards that expensive category. So that makes sense. But there is the packaging on the outside, Apple, one Apple Parkway, Cupertino, California, 95014, Apple Incorporated, all rights reserved, all that good stuff. Let's open it up. Oh, there it is. It's got that color coding and I'm noticing that change some within the Apple car on the wallet. So it changes depending on the categories that you spend your apple car at so like if you spend a certain categories and it will lean towards a certain color and then it gets blended with the other colors when you start spinning towards other kind of categories so at first i thought it was just going to be this white gray the whole time but as i've been using it i've been noticed it changed like green and pink and purple and all these colors so that's that gradient that they're showing you right there that's how it's going to look in your wallet once you start actually using it but when you don't use it it's going to look like this this is snug in here and it says, hold iPhone here to activate car. All right. Please activate your car before use. Here's the car. This is very sturdy. Look at that. This is, this is a thick car right here. Like this, I mean, I'm sure I could bend this and break this or snap it or bend it, but I'm not going to do that. But this is, like, I'm giving it a little bit of force right there. And uh, yeah, that's the metal right there. It's titanium. And it feels like it. It's got the, let's see if that's etched. Lightly etched logo let me get it out of focus so somewhat lightly etched not very deep but it's not just print so that is etched right there my name printed on there but it's you can kind of feel it a little bit so it's not etched in there like the apple logo but it's printed on there with some kind of heavy ink or dye or something because i could kind of feel it and you have the chip cart right there i'm gonna turn it over and see all right yeah just want to make sure you didn't know if it was going to be numbers on the back or anything so no numbers on the back just has goldman sachs which is what the card is provided through that bank goldman sachs one of the largest banks in the united states and mastercard you know mastercard the second largest credit card issuer in the world or i know it definitely in the united states i'm guessing in the world as well but yeah mastercard and goldman sachs and there is the stripe right there so if you still have the places where you have to slide it or swipe it and there's like a little you can tell like a little it's not like smooth right here it's a little somewhat dip and dention between the swiping part and the card part right there but that's like a silver metal and this is a white see goldman sachs is definitely etched in there and a mastercard feels like it's lightly etched in there yeah lightly etched in there with that silver as well that is the apple card very minimalistic sleek sturdy 
and I'm going to activate the car with my iPhone. I'm going to, I'm going to actually hold it right there and see what happens. So yeah, I held my phone near that section on the envelope that says hold iPhone here to activate car. And it automatically brought it up on my phone. As you see on the screen recording, you know, tap of the button there, continue. And that's it. The card is activated. Very seamless, easy process right there. No calling a number, no logging in to an account or anything like that. Just a help the phone literally right here. The top of the phone was right there. And it automatically, after like a second or two, it came up on the phone, as you see. And the activation process, very seamless. That's it. Hope you all enjoyed the Apple Card unboxing video. Take care.